welcome back to Heartwave Creation. In this video, I'm gonna talk about both Avante 1500 or 1550 model wireless Bluetooth multimedia speaker. As always, I have categorized this video into three segments. In the very first segment, I'll talk about the feature specs, design and connectivity this speaker has to offer. For this, I'll directly take you to the site as the, that's the best place to get the accurate specs. In the second segment, I'll show you the customer rating graph between sites and some connectivity tips directly from the customer review comments. And in the third segment, the last but not the least, the price graph, which will help you to understand when to buy or what was the lowest price the speaker went so far so that you can understand whether you will wait for the price to go down or not. So that's all depends on you. So I uh, hope this video helps you uh, for your purchase. Stay tuned till the end. Do subscribe and like. So let's start. So this is the Boat Avante 1500 model, uh, which is listed in Amazon over here. But in Flipkart, the same thing is listed as 1550 model. So don't get confused. Both the specs are same. I'll walk you through it. So if you can see, if I uh, tell you about the design and all, so this is uh, basically the 2.1, that means two speaker unit and one subwoofer unit you get with a remote addition to it. So if you talk about the entire uh, uh, the design of the side uh, speaker, this is very premium look and the build quality is good. As you can see, I have zoomed it over here. So in the side, you have the power unit and the volume plus or minus and the USB unit over here. So if I talk about the connectivity on the back side, the same thing is uh, listed as it is a Bluetooth wireless connectivity. You can connect your phone through it or uh, your TV, of course, through it. If you have a connectivity of Bluetooth from your TV, you can connect this as output source. And uh, then you have an aux, aux in over here. So that means you can connect from TV or from your 3.5 mm jack from your phone. Anything you can connect if you want to connect through wired and i shown you the usb and then it has hdmi arc that means it is an audio return channel so that means if you have a hdmi arc port in tv you can directly plug this to your uh, uh, bluetooth speaker so that would be a perfect connection this is an optical uh, input audio input cable over here which is for audio transmission between tv and or the source and the speaker let me tell you this is a 120 watt uh, uh, RMS power subwoofer and in the subwoofer unit is 60 watt. The remote has many presets in that you get a 3D stereo surround sound which gives a good feeling as if you are in the uh, hall, you are in the multiplex uh, watching movies. If you like it, you can switch that on. And let me tell you about uh, one uh, connectivity over here which is a good over here. That means this the bar bar is directly uh, input from the dc input is uh, to the bar and then you get one cable from this uh, subwoofer unit which has to be plugged inside bar so it is your choice whether you want to plug whether you want to get the bars it is not a prefix it is you want to connect or you don't want to connect that's on you and at the same time you get a button over here if i show you the bass minus and blah bass plus so that means if you press bass minus, the subwoofer unit will be suppressed and bass plus will enhance the subwoofer unit. So you have entire control over here and it has many uh, treble minus and treble plus also. So these are all connectivity and uh, design. It's, uh, it's a premium look, I must say. And here the subwoofer, uh, subwoofer unit, the, it is down powering, I must say. And then if I go to the flip card, so let's go to the specs. If I will, uh, it's a 2.1 channel and 120 watt total power output and the frequency response. If you can see in my last video, I have told about the Bota 1100 model where the frequency was uh, something different. And here you get a bit uh, 45 uh, hertz, uh, starting from 45 hertz to 20 kilohertz. So that means again in here also the deep bass is still missing. The deep bass uh, specification will start from 20 hertz or 30 hertz. So if I show you the Amazon uh, purchase graph and the customer rating here, if you can see, this is the ratings over here. 
so that means uh, one star definitely you will get for every good product so believe me that's nothing to be uh, get disappointed with so if you can see it has a well rating of 4.3 to uh, out of 5 star and same if i could show it over here in flipkart you get a proper uh, uh, good purchase and good review and rating over here you can see the various uh, user uh, response over here so this is a good buy so in the slide uh, over here i have uh, given some tips uh, from the customer review comments directly from their usage so you will get a clear picture and uh, you may have few doubts which you can get clarity from and here uh, the first person has given a connect, uh, connection with Alexa how they have connected it works uh, perfect it sounds good also and the second person has also a problem with the org's input but which was get uh, cleared with the uh, HDMI and then they mostly I uh, found from the customer reviews they are connecting uh, from the Bluetooth unit uh, to their TV which works uh, very smooth so and uh, this size if you want to know what was the uh, what is the size of this uh, bar sound bar it is it's well suits and best fit for 43 inch TV so it doesn't matter but uh, just uh, for a standard reference I given this uh, thing and uh, here there is a one more tip also you can also turn up the display light uh, the display light is in the sound bar which shows which mode you are connected in whether it is uh, in the aux mode whether it is in the optical or hdmi so it's just display so you can always turn it off uh, by this comment uh, as i could see so this is all about it and in the third segment of this video i said i will show you the price graph of course i will show you so uh, you will get a clear picture whether you should wait for the purchase or not so if you can see the listed price uh, over here in the amazon currently on today is 7499 and if I show you the price graph, let's see the variation of this product over time. And uh, here you see the lowest price in Amazon is 6490 and the average price stays is 8019. So not bad. So this price might get reduced in 6490. That means uh, this was the lowest price. Uh, not exactly. Okay. Uh, this was the lowest price on August 9th, uh, which is one time lowest i can say over here so let's say uh, switch to uh, flipkart uh, to see what is the price uh, variation over here so okay that's very amazing here you can see the lowest price is 5999 and uh, this stays for uh, two to three days i could see over here in july 16th and uh, also again on friday uh, this, this is a bit high but anyways uh, this is lowest than the Amazon so average price is a bit high but you can wait till the price goes down for any offer or Diwali is coming up or the Sarai is coming up so anyways uh, these are all the things uh, which you can wait for so by this time you got the clear picture or when to buy and all hope this video helps you for your purchase and stay connected with me for my next upcoming videos and the comparison videos in the soundbar and the home theater series. So here we go again. Thanks for watching Heartbeat Creation. Do like and subscribe us and stay tuned with us for the videos like this. Have a good day ahead.